हेलो हाय एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल एस टी बी अकाडमी हाई टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट टॉपिक इज ह्यूमन एंड कलरफुल वर्क सो व्हाट इज ह्यूमन एंड एंड हाउ अबाउट द कलरफुल वर्क सो ह्यूमन एंड द मोस्ट सेंसिबल आर्ग इन आर ह्यूमन बॉडी दैट इज का ह्यूमन एंड ओके so how can you able to see the beautiful things around us like a rainbow and so like so many colors in the nature how we can able to identify all these things because of eyes because of our eyes right even if you are watching the video also because of the our eyes yeah true right yes so now we will deeply discuss about the uh, human eye are you ready yes 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 okay then. so human eye now you can see here i am taking the human eye so if i consider a round shape you have to take like this you can take like that shape you are considering like that so while you are drawing you must draw like this then you can take one more so here you can start then you can consider like this so almost it will be elliptical shape right then you can take the optic now like this and here also optic now yes now we can go with the cornea right so what is the cornea the outer most layer so front layer of the human eye then consider like this yes so this uh, outer most front layer okay so when light enters most of the refraction takes place here then we can consider one more that is lens so what is the lens lens you can see here i'm considering the lens like this and they are also in considering the islands yes islands you can take okay so up to here only it will be there okay fine no problem then you can consider the ciliary muscles where ciliary muscles will be there then here you can take the ciliary muscles okay like this you can consider yes yes and here also you can consider ciliary muscles so where it will be okay so holding the lens okay yes 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 right you can see on the screen how it is so you can see on the screen right okay so this is the cornea and this is the optic nerve and here ciliary muscles eye lens and you can see here one more it will be there that is so actually until here it will be there so the iris iris part will be there entire iris will be there okay and here also so you can consider this the iris okay so this about the human eye and you can consider the like this colors okay then so then what about the optic now so here you can see here i am taking like this optic now so the all the nerves will be meeting at one point then uh, so like this yes so you can consider like this here you can consider this the optic now so where uh, all the nerves will be meeting so you can see this all all will be whatever it is there so we are considering all the nerves will be here okay so this about the human eye and we will discuss about the parts what are the parts here so we will discuss so one is cornea so print uh, separate, separate color we can take okay so yes pink color or 
yellow also fine dark yellow that's fine okay so you can take this the cornea this the cornea cornea we can consider and if you take so this iris iris will be considered iris okay and you can consider this the pupil so where is the the middle portion where the light rays will enter okay where light rays will allow so enter so that is called pupil so p u p i l pupil and next one you can consider this the what is that hmm. ciliary muscles ciliary muscles you can take ciliary muscles and you can consider ciliary muscles okay ciliary you can take and here you can take here it is retina this is the retina okay and this one will be the optic nerve optic nerve optic nerve so here it will be the retina here it will be the optic nerve cornea and pupil the front portion will be the pupil and uh, iris so this two will be the iris you can take this also and ciliary muscles this and this one where where the lens is holding okay so this portion will be considered the ciliary muscle so this is the retina optic nerve and the blind spot will be there so here it is the blind spot okay so where the light rays does not meet okay blind spot right so this is about the eye diagram human eye human eye this will be the human eye human eye okay so here individual uh, one by one we will discuss so cornea cornea is the most outer most part of the human eye where most of the refraction takes place so when the light rays will be entering so you can see here when the light rays uh, are entering so approximately a diagram drawing like this you can consider so like this so where the most of the light rays will enter okay so their image will be so here in this portion okay so where the most of the refraction so light rays will enter light rays will be entering then then what happens so most of the refraction takes place what is the refraction refraction is that but so when you are taking one medium to another medium the light is passing from one medium to another medium what happens it will bend towards the normal line so i'm considering this is the light ray it will be incident on the line so if you are taking this incident ray so uh, it's a normal line it will be bending towards the normal line so it will bending towards the normal line so like that so you can consider here so in the cornea when the light is entering when the light enters the most of the refraction takes place what is the most of the refraction it bends towards the normal so normal line like that so then it will enters so it will passes through the uh, people so what the people here is the people so here you can see so here is the people the portion this portion will be the considered as the people okay so iris will control the size of the people so which one will control is iris iris will control the size of the people so size of the people people will control people will control amount of light entering into the eye people okay so iris so what is iris duty it will control the size of the people size of the people okay so people people will control see this one this side so this one will be there no people people will control the amount of light entering into the eye. amount of light entering into the eye so what is eye lens eye lens will converge see so when you are taking the lens like this okay so whenever the light rays will incident on it it will converge the conversion of light rays takes place here also whenever the light rays are falling and you know falling on it like this it passes through it so it will falls and it makes light rays to converge and those light rays will passes through that so here yeah, and meet at retina so it will meet at retina so actually so one is uh, one more liquid will be there between cornea and the lens so that is uh, aqueous humor so we can consider uh, aqueous humor you can take okay so aqueous humor 
aqueous human it's like a jelly type liquid where it is a transparent liquid it will allow the light to pass through it it allows us to light to pass through it, it will be here. So that is aqueous humor. And here it is, what is humor will be there? Virtuous humor. Okay, virtuous humor will be there. Virtuous humor. Okay, so virtuous humor will be there. So in this, between the lens and the retina. Okay, so when the light uh, coming and passing through it, so it will, it is a transparent jelly type liquid. So it allows the light to pass through it. There the all light rays will uh, meet at retina. So, so what is the retina? Light, uh, retina is like a light sensitive screen. So when light, uh, when light incident on it, then li uh, light rays will be incidenting on it. So the image will form. So object image will be formed at retina. So that will be converted in the form of signals. That will be converted into in the form of signals. So what type of image will be forming? Inverted and real image will be forming at retina. Inverted and real image will form at retina. That will passes through the optic nerve. So that image will be converted in the form of electrical signals. So that electrical signals will passes through the optic nerve to the brain. To the brain. Okay. So these are the these are the path. Okay. Light rays will pass. Us. The electrical signals will pass us through the optic nerve to the brain. So here blind spot. So there won't be any image will be formed. That's why it will be considered as a blind spot. So this is about the uh, human eye. So we covered all the parts. And here in uh, at retina there are uh, two types of cells are there. And here you can see ciliary muscles. So what are ciliary muscles use means? So it will hold the lens. Okay. So it will uh, when you are seeing the, the distance object, distance object. So it will uh, you know adjust the size of the eye lens to see the objects. When you are seeing nearby object also, it will adjust the size to see the nearby objects. So that is the purpose of the ciliary muscles. It uh, adjusts the curvature of the eye lens. And next one. Uh, so at retina, so at retina there are uh, two light sensitive cells are there. So uh, what are those? One is rod, other one is cones. Rod sense the dim light and color. Rod sense the intensity of the light. Intensity of the light. So even in the night time also we can able to see the objects. So oval can see during night time because more rods will be there. So uh, coming to the cones, cones will see. So it will be sense the colors it will be sensing the color of the light okay so rod sense the intensity of the light intensity of the light so in the night time we can see so that is the reason so it has more rods so whereas cones you can see so it will sense the color of the light so these are the light sensitive cells present at retina so this is about the human eye so in the coming video, we'll be discussing about uh, more about uh, human eye and their uh, refractive defects. So stay tuned. Thank you.